confirmed survivors. Everyone else that wasn't related to me died. Everything on this planet has evolved to kill people. Leave me alone, bird! Leave me alone! Don't mess with me! Hey, tiger! Tiger! Don't mess with me! Stop it, tiger! Don't bother me, tiger! Don't bother me at all! Just start attacking me for no reason! The temperatures on this planet fluctuate dangerously. Ugh, it's really cold. Wait, I'll just put on my jacket. But if we're going to survive this, you must realize fear is not real. Now don't get me wrong, the danger is real. I mean, it hurts. It hurts a lot. Have you ever got shot in the leg? That hurts. Like, worst pain in the world. My leg is broken. I won't be able to do anything at all through this entire movie at all. It's all relying on you, son. It is up to you to carry this movie by yourself. I will just narrate and I won't leave the seat at all. I'm counting on you to do all the acting for me. Do you know where we is, boy? No, sir. Earth. There's an emergency beacon 100 kilometers from here. You must retrieve the beacon. Oh, he's gonna die? Oh, he's gonna die. Takai, you're acting too stupid. Abort the mission. You wouldn't give any other ranger that order. You're not a ranger. You're my son. You can do it, Katai. Are you daydreaming about your dead sister again? Stop it. We already know she's dead. It's not a twist. She wasn't at the beginning of the movie, so where would she be now? Just making my mission not boring, sir. 60 years ago, Earth was attacked. We won the war, but they destroyed half the planet. Everyone's been evacuated. Nothing human remains. Well, obviously, because I'm not a human. We're here for drone repair. Even though they kill us at any sudden movements. Easy, easy, easy. Just trying to repair you. We're the mop-up crew. So, gotta sweep all of this. I'll take it from here, Wally. <gasps> you! You're the one who set off the beacon! Who goes there? Who are you? Back away! Back away! There's no people on this planet! I'm the only one! Dad and I, we crashed on this planet. My dad, he's in danger. He's back at the ship. He's almost dead. And so you had to go out and get the beacon by yourself and go through all kinds of crazy adventures? No, just the weather and a bunch of animals. And, and that's a movie that you're in or you're just describing a regular National Geographic documentary? All right, I will help you. Uh-oh. Oh, Fox, it's the drones. Wow, you are in a better movie. Run! Ah! Oh, thanks, Scientology. He's still alive. Thank you for bringing my son back and rescuing us. Why Why do you have those terrible accents? You know, you could just talk normal. I mean, it's a sci-fi. You want to define all this extra background stuff that nobody cares about. Well, who do I thank for saving my life? My name is Jack Reacher. I mean, uh, Jack, um, Jack Foxer. Yes. I'm Cypher Rage. Really? Wow, did you write this movie? How'd you know? Dad, I don't want to be an actor anymore. 